Welcome to Gate Matra 01, classroom where we solve gate questions using easy to remember and cross cut methods. For today's first question, we have if a system is initially at rest, the response to unit step u of t is given by 1 by 2 into 1 minus e to the power of minus 2t. The response to a signal u of t plus 2 delta of t is given by. So, from question, we are able to understand that the response of u of t is given to us and we need to find the response of u of t plus 2 delta of t. To solve this question, you have to know a single most important formula which is d by dt of unit step is equal to unit impulse. The d by dt or the differential defines a function with rate of change. And taking the rate of change of a unit step function gives you 1, which is your delta function. So the most important formula for this numerical and several other numericals for the gate exam is d by dt of u of t is equal to delta of t. Now, this question becomes a straightforward case of applying this formula where 2 delta of t is solved using the new found differential formula which is 2 of d by dt of u of t and the response of u of t is given as 1 by 2 so we are going to substitute this in this form and then differentiate it then you get what is 2 of delta of t and then add these two so after doing this we are going to add it and then further simplification will give as the final answer which is 1 by 2 plus 3 by 2 e to the power of minus 2t. That is your answer choice a. Coming to other similar questions based on the question 1 into find the response of u of t minus 2 delta of t, u of t into 2 delta of t and delta of t. Now let's move to the next question, which is finding Laplace transform of the given waveform. Now for gate, we need to study a whole bunch of formulas of which Laplace transform of basic signals is a compulsory choice. So this question can be most simply solved by decomposing the given signal into standard signals of ramp and step. Knowing the Laplace transform of ramp and step is much needed when you go for gate exam. The Laplace transform of ramp has different variants where the amplitude and time can take upon different values. In this case, the amplitude is A and amplitude is T that is the most standard form for the Laplace equation. When the amplitude becomes 1 and the time duration becomes 1, as in the given question, we are looking at a substituted formula where a is equal to 1 and t is equal to 1. The third form of a ramp variation is when your ramp signal extends towards infinity. In that case, the Laplace transform is simply 1 upon s square. So these are the three variants of ramp equations that a student needs to know going into the gate exam. For the unit step signal, we need to obtain what is the mathematical formulation, which is in this case u of t minus 1 minus u of t minus 2. Uh, u of t minus 1 is represented in this form, and u of t minus 2 represented starting from 2. Taking the difference of these two will give you the question waveform, which is valid from 1 to 2. Knowing this concept makes it easier to understand several other waveforms of unit step which ranges from 3 to 4, 0 to 2, minus 1 to minus 2, minus 1 to 2. All these variations have been previously asked in gate exam and so knowing this and representing this waveform in this form makes it much easier to crack these questions. The Laplace transform for unit step is given as 1 upon s 
for a shifted unit step it's given as 1 by s e to the power of minus s if the shift is towards the left side it is plus 1 s towards the minus side it is minus 1 s and if the shift is by 2 unit it is given by minus 2 s so knowing this laplace form and the laplace form for the ramp now this question becomes a straightforward solution of applying the ramp laplace and the unit step laplace and taking the sum so simplifying the summation you get the answer choice b the other variations of similar question seen now as question 2 are these now these questions must be you must be able to solve these questions pretty easy coming to the final question for of this session find the correct laplace transform for the given signal so this question must look familiar to the previous question and you must think it must be solved in a gfi since we know how the ramp laplace works but there is a catch here the ramp slope is decreasing or negative so for the negative slope the ramp equation is given by a minus at upon t whereas for an increasing or a positive slope your ramp equation is just at upon t knowing this different values for a and t will alter your equation in this manner now applying this new formula for a decreasing ramp we get our equation as 1 minus t by t which is 1 minus ramp of 1 comma t or laplace of 1 minus laplace of ramp of 1 comma t the laplace of 1 is computed using the laplace transform formula valid from 0 to t integral of 1 into e to the power of minus st solving you get this ramp from previous question we get this so always you need to check whether the question is for positive or negative ramp and modify your equation accordingly now applying both this from laplace transform and taking the difference and simplifying you get your matching answer choice c thank you for listening if you like more solve questions on gate matra please subscribe to show your interest thank you